All right. Hello, everybody. This is Duo Lies. She is Duo Sect, and this is our last Duo videotape. This is week 10 in the Duo Tournament 5 here in Mortal Voyage Permadeath Guild, and we're doing Mira's Sleepless Nights. Mira's Sleepless Nights. Mira here. How good to see you again, Mirians. I'm sorry I've not been sleeping well at all. I keep hearing odd noises like a person wailing followed by the sounds of scratching coming from my basement. Uh, that's creepy as hell, Mira. You should call somebody else. Have you been into that basement to check these noises? Into the basement? Goodness, no. Kenton made sure that I never went in the basement. Nothing there for me. It was his space. And since his death, I have not had the heart to go there. Mira pauses. Would you be interested in helping me find out what is causing the noises? Want me to go down in your basement and check things out? I don't know. Sounds like a trip. What would you like me to do? How kind of you. Go in the basement, find the source of the wailing and scratching. If you can make it stop, I would be most appreciative. I will find out what is causing your sleepless nights. May the blessing of the sovereign host be with you. If you find anything dangerous there. Thank you again, dual lies. Mm-hmm. I'll be careful. All right. Well, those of you that are familiar with this quest, know that it's a little higher difficulty than the previous quest we've been running in the tournament. This is the final week. This will be level 7 on hard. And uh, she, she's excited over there bouncing up and down. And in we go. Alright, that's a specter. That's probably a sign of things to come. A little DDO foreshadowing. We're going to stand right here for just a second and talk about the build. My stats I somehow got them buggered with my decks. I meant to get that to 18 somehow, but things didn't really go as well as I wanted them to, and uh, I didn't really feel like rebuilding it. So I'm just a pure rogue, as rogue and wizard are our classes for this week. Enhancement-wise, I took a skill boost. Eh, we're well under level. This is a level 7 quest for level 4. We're only two manning things. I did as much here with... Uh, Disable device, open lock, and uh, spot search listen. Got the use of the giant crossbow, which is what I use here. Got the thunderstone and the tangle foot. And that's it. In truth, I kind of kind of recommend the agent of good and making your weapon plus one. And the reason for that is this particular weapon isn't really magical. doesn't really do any extra magic damage. But that's three points I didn't want to take out of my skills, so... Uh, I got some Masterwork Thieves tools, some healer's kits just in case she goes down, plenty of regular old bolts, and nothing. And this is the starter gear I came with, as is all of this. And this is my rogue gear. I got spot, I got search, I got disable. That was my nimble grasp. So honey, tell us about your build. Duo sect. Ooh, so basically you walk up and smash things with a big sword. Nice. What enhancements did you take uh, as a cleric wizard? Did you get up the, uh, did you, did you say you went up, uh, what line you went up? Nice. Looks like you have quite a few more hit points than me. Shall we go find out what's happening down here? Oh, we got buffies.
that looks like you have some extend going there. Nice. A musty scent fills the air. The only obvious exit lies behind you. It's a lever over there. And uh, apparently nothing else. I'm not super familiar with this quest. I don't know what the DCs are for being able to find anything or what kind of crap to really expect. I didn't do an awful lot of homework on this quest. We've put off running the quest, hoping that many other people would finish the tournament and kind of uh, lead a little expectation, maybe a little little drama, but uh, it's meant to be friendly, you know, um, good competitive nature drama, not, uh, not kind of angry drama, all peaceful here. Uh, door, lever, opening. Yeah, that's not creepy or trappy. Come on in. Let me take a look around the room. Alright, I neither spot anything nor do I see any signs of a trap. So, uh, let's go take it out. Uh, what do you say? Gently. Gently. Okay, that wasn't as gentle as I'd hoped. That was fairly handy. Just is locked. I do not have an open lock item. So apparently 20 is failure. Oh, 30 is success. You know, I do. I do want a pot of cast grace. The bad guy in hiding here. Impenetrable magical barrier.
Ancient texts written in an unknown language line the walls. Oh, bad guys. Run away. You were a goner there. Sister Myra knows nothing of the evil that I do. I have constructed two iron columns. I saw those. Perhaps I should call upon the other lords to help me. Sour so plunder the riches. Oh, what riches? Not give my peers cause to see so the plunder the riches. The place of the dark altar was constructed. The defiance of the silver flame intended to work on a spell to struggle against the passage. Yeah, no tower will be cleansed of this light. Mm. How the juicy stuff. Should I fail? Should I fall? I hope that this journal is found one day. These records may help others destroy the evil that I now go to confront. And perhaps I lay my own spirit to rest if the worst comes to pass. CP. Alright, well that was scary stuff. Another unguarded show. Oh, danger. Look at that. This is my spot. Toy. I could have put a few more points into this spot. I didn't have to put them into disable and such, but. You hear the sound of I bones grinding on stone, but it is too soft to explain Mira's sleeplessness. What's that word? More danger. More danger. Nice, a little arcane necklace. It's a sweet gift from the cleric line. All right, did I get a, oh, nice. All right, my plan is to go up the ladder. Up there's a lever. And we'll see what happens. All right, up the ladder might not be the best idea. I'm gonna hide behind here. I can't deal damage to the They're all dead. No, there's it.
Oh, more danger. Can I search up here? No. seem to be off. We seem to come in from that direction. Let's see if we can go this direction. Uh, shrine or no shrine? Well, let's use this door back here to draw bad guys too. And I will open this door and then run the hell away if there's a... Whoa! Okay. Bad guys. Let's run away, remember? This is our door. Magical wards charged with positive energy line the hall. I didn't see any other wards. You have to take them down, you think? Not spotting any danger. Oh, crap, that scared the shit out of me. Holy cow. I was looking for a trap. It said positive wards, positive energy, and I'm thinking, okay, this means trap. I got to do something. You know, thought they were trying to give me a warning. Holy shit, that scared me. Huh, is there a chest or something in there? Oh, you want to fight the bad guy? Let's hit that shrine and come back and kick his ass. He probably has a chest. You know he has a chest, right? He looks all chesty. You want the loot. You just want to see what it is. <laughs> Be honest. Curiosity has killed the cat many times. I'm not talking about the kind of curiosity that happens in your college dorm late at night when you can't sleep. You're all messed up on Ridlin trying to cram for exams. Yep, your roommate falls asleep. Is this... Oh, the door shut here? No, the chest looked trapped as hell. Camera's locked. Alright, I'm opening it. Oh, you want a resident scepter of evocation focus? Grow deeds. Belt of Seeking. Ooh. High gold. It's just the right way. Hmm. Looks like a pretty straightforward quest, doesn't it? Alright, let's go through here. Crap, that guy scared the shit out of me. Scared the heck out of me. Heck. Okay, he appears to be alone. That wasn't good. Did you shut the door? I'm free, bless you. I 
have no chest, huh? Drink the rest of the That's some bull. That's some bull's naughty. Bull's not. about to die. Holy crap. I was in a falling motion. Stuck right there. That went crazy. No chest, really? Well, that's disappointing. Alright, finish it out. Go and recover our loot. XP-wise, we got, uh... Well, let's just face it. Things went horribly wrong for the bad guys. We got ransacked, persistent, flawless. Completion time, and on hard. The worst part of that was the traps, and then that unknown part of the end where I actually thought there was the DM was telling me there was some sort of a trap there. Well, Nera, tell me all about it. I found the source of wetting and scratching, but I'm afraid that the reasons are going to be very painful for you. Your brother Canton did not die at sea as you thought. He died in the basement trying to seal away some threat that lay deep beneath the tower in the city. Oh, Canton, you fool. You fool, Canton. Tears well in her eyes, always poking about where you did not belong. Poke, 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 poke. Hmm. Well. That's kind of a fun little quest. Uh, I haven't ran that quest in, in a bit. And so, uh, it was kind of, uh, entertaining. I was uh, familiar with some of the concepts in there, and obviously the big specter when you walk into the quest is a clue. But uh, that was kind of fun. I've enjoyed the tournament. I hope that all the other participants have enjoyed the tournament as much as we have. I seriously can't even hope you guys have enjoyed watching these tapes as much as we've enjoyed making them, simply because I've tried watching them, and I find them to be just a little bit dull. Just a little bit dull. So... I wish you all the very best. Good hunting, good fortune, and stay alive. This is Duo Lies. Say goodbye, Duo Sect. And we're signing off for uh, Duo Videotape. Oh, she bowed. So sweet. And thanks again for watching in the Duo Tournament 5.